Hey, what's up on my Aquarius people? You have reached my channel, Royal Revelations, and I am BJ Royal. All right, you guys, so I'm coming to you guys today with a timeless love reading, okay? So this is for anybody with Aquarius placements in their chart. I tell everybody, tarot card readings are like advice. You can take it or you leave it either way. That's fine with me. It may not be a message for you, but it's definitely a message for somebody. So any cards that I use, any um, information about personal readings is going to be listed in the description box below. So let's get this thing started. For my Aquarius people. Alright, so we're going to start off with the Price of Love Oracle. We're going to get three of these. Ooh. <laughs> ah, are you dealing with a Scorpio? Scorpio had this in the background, but separation. Um, I'm here, but now that we're separated... We can't stand one another. It's really over, baby. Because you did me wrong. Okay. You did me wrong. I thought you were true. You ran out of my life and now. Robotic. I'm so through with you. Mm. But are you really? Passionate. Okay. Ah. Manipulation. Okay. Let's see. I don't know. Let me check. Let me look this up because I want to know about Avant. Okay. So his birthday is April 26th. Okay. 426. So he is a um probably a Taurus. He could be on the cusp. Mm, not quite the cusp. I, I feel like maybe he's like a true uh he might be a true, 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 true Taurus, okay? So this could have something to do with money too. Um, Cause I'm getting second house energy. But yeah, I feel like, yeah, somebody ran out of your life and you swore you was through with them, but uh, I feel like y'all back at it again, or, you know, you could be just be dealing with somebody else. So let's see, but somebody trying to manipulate somebody. How do you feel? Let's get one lyric for you and one lyric. For your persons, but one for you first. Jackson 5, I'll be there. If you should ever find someone new, I know he better be good to you. Because if he doesn't, I'll be there. Don't you know, baby? Yeah, I'll be there. Oh, my God. So, I feel like, I don't even feel like this is y'all. I feel like this is the other person saying this to you. <laughs> so, like, somebody that is in the background kind of hanging around or like an ex or something like they trying to come back around because maybe you broke up with somebody else mm, let's see what they say i don't know y'all should get juicy already oh shit that lyric fell out let me go get it you know i'm fat and pregnant Let's see. Jaheen, finding my way back. Did I not say that? <laughs> it says, trying to find my way back, way back to you, baby. Gotta find my way back, way back to you, to us, to love. Man down, my heart's in your hands now. Hit your love another X in the sand now. No clues, no maps, damn. So I'm digging till I end up in Japan. Oh, three years it said that it was painless. Dialing out, drowning in the is it the something of my anguish show, but three years may be significant. Maybe it's been two or three years since you guys been dealing with each other. Oh shit. I feel like it might be I'm getting like it's too much going on. I feel like maybe you have a couple of people. 
Because I feel like you got somebody trying to be there for you. And then somebody trying to find their way back to your ass. And I don't know how this is turning out, y'all. Then you got this uh, manipulation here. This Capricorn energy. Some of you guys could be cuspers or somebody trying to hold on to your ass. Let's see. Mm-mm. If you should ever find someone new. <laughs> and apparently he won't good to you, so I'm back. What's up? And they there. They playing that friend role. Here go that Capricorn energy, the mountain. 21. So somebody's trying to help you through a hard time or they're trying to help you with a breakup or help you through a breakup or maybe you just talk to this person in order to get through this breakup. You had the 23, this, okay, the cinch, uh, not cinch, not the cinch, but I'm getting like a, not snitch either. Okay, somebody might be doing that, but uh, what the fuck is the word I'm trying to come up with? Uh, mooching. Yeah, mooching. Oh, it's getting deep, y'all. Give me one more. What's passion? Because this person, they always, somebody's always coming back or somebody's coming back to be greedy. Then you have all oh, the tulips. And then the fish. It's more, it's like two or three people. Two or three people. Some birthdays could be uh, <laughs> 12, 23, 12, 28, 12, 27, 12, 29, 1, 322, 321, 329, 328, 327, and 923, 921, 924, 928, 927. <sighs> Shit. It's too many people, y'all. Eight. It's, I see some August, August 21st, August 23rd, August 29th, July 21st, July 23rd. It's, it's too much. It's too many people. Somebody trying to come back. So I'm I'm low-key thinking that it might be some drama. Cause I just don't know if both of these is people, both of these people. So the letter J could be significant. Jackson and Jaheen. Japan. Like they they come, they who? So some shit happens in three. Something happens in threes. Oh shit. But somebody is bigger than the other one. Somebody is coming back a little bit harder than the other one. Okay. So these are three different scenarios. Aquarius. Why is it? Why is this all the time with y'all? Okay. Y'all be having these options, boy. <laughs> Like, I'm getting literally three different scenarios, kid. Three different people, man. I almost want to pull another lyric for the third person because I swear I think it's three people. Let me pull one more. Because this person, these, I don't even think this is you. These are other people trying to be there for you. Hold on. Let me get one more. I swear I think it's one more person. Because this person is coming harder. But let's see. I don't know. What I say. Lauren Hill can't take my eyes off of you. You're just too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you. You be like heaven to touch. I want to hold you so much. At long last, love has arrived. And I thank God I'm alive. You're just too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you. do 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 I need you, baby. Okay. I'm telling you, because somebody is like passionate, they romantic, they coming through with the flowers. These other people, I ain't saying they ain't shit, but it could be, you know what I'm saying? Cause something was rocky and you know, y'all just went y'all separate ways. And you know, this person is always the same shit. You know, they try to eat off of you, or it's just like a 
real shit all the way back over. That's fucked up. They trying to find their way back. And this person is, they can't take their eyes off of you. Y'all see that? Okay, y'all about to have the litest love reading. I don't know. I am still think it might be a little bit of drama, so. Let's see. What's separation in this mountain? Okay, Ten of Swords in here in reverse. Somebody's not trying. I was about to say, I think this is the Capricorn. Or the Earth sign or something. You have the devil in reverse. Or this is something. Oh. This was a very toxic relationship. It was very hard. Like this, I feel like this was never an easygoing relationship, but it's not over. There's something that's preventing it from being over with this Ten of Swords in reverse. So it could be a lack of closure, something. Or this person just don't want you to find somebody new. What's this uh, robotic energy? The Queen of Cups is in reverse. I guess somebody's like jealous. The seven of coins is here. Or maybe you're just like closed off or you friends on this person or something like that. I feel like, or maybe you're just not reachable. Somebody been trying to call your phone. You're trying to find your seven digits. They're trying to call your phone number. Yeah, that's interesting. Two, three, two, that's seven. Somebody's been trying to call you. And they cannot get up with you. You're not fucking with them at all. <laughs> You're not fucking with them at all, Aquarius. It's like, you was done with them. Like, you know, maybe it was some love lost over here, but you really ain't fucking with them. Like, this person did a lot to you. I feel like... They used you. They they depleted your energy. They didn't fill your cup up. They took from it. Ah, the three of cups. I like this energy over here. It must be new energy. Yes, yeah, six of wands. This person, you guys work together. It could be literally work together, but maybe you guys have some common interests. Maybe you guys like being around each other. This shit is just much more sweeter, much more calm. Like you guys cook, might cook together, eat together. Like especially with all the like the strawberries. You might, you guys might create together. Like you kissing all the time, and I don't know if you was really attracted to this person. At all. I don't know, but like this, these are th three different energies. What's this Ten of Swords in reverse? Okay, Aquarius. So, Aries just called me and interrupted the reading. So, it could be an Aries, but on this first row or Capricorn or something. Let's see. Let's see. The Nine of Cups is in reverse. I almost feel bad, bad for this person because they really love you. Maybe it's them that, that really loves you. It could be a Gemini. But this person, I mean, they never got over you. That's why they're always, like, you can call them for anything and they'll always be there because I don't know if they really took it, like, it's kind of that energy of you don't know something is missing until it's gone. And now that it's gone, it's like they, like, they mope over you. It's like, damn, like, they just want to hold you. They just want to be close to you. Like, they miss how you feel, that you like your warmth, your touch. Like, they miss everything about you. Oh, that's why I said I almost feel sorry for this person, but I almost don't. Because, obviously, you guys went your separate ways for a reason. They didn't hold on to you, or they didn't know how to hold on to you, or they didn't know how to treat you. I feel like maybe you was doing a lot for them, catering to them, and doing shit for them. But then, it's like, I think you got burnt out, or you got tired or some shit. What's the Queen of Cups in reverse? Oh, it was two. The two of cups. 
and the death card in reverse. Okay, so clearly this person has not changed. Let's let's stay stay clear, right? Um, but you have the ten of pentacles here, so <laughs> maybe maybe this person wants like some type of family unit with you, um, or maybe you guys had a family. Or um, I feel like this person could have also been like, you know, dealing with flings or something like that with this two of cups. I feel like maybe you guys won't deal with each other for long or something like that before you kind of realize like this is not what you want. Like this person, I feel like you kept putting into this person, but they weren't putting enough into you. So this is some type. OK, so that makes sense because this is some type of robotic pattern. The dynamic of these relationships were two different relationships, right? But it still, to me, holds the same energy that you were putting into these people and they were only giving you but so much. And that's why you're so burnt out. And I think that's why you got burnt out much quicker with this person than you did. Like I feel like you held on longer or something with this person and this person, you just like, I, absolutely not. It was just so familiar, the J, the J, the J, right? So, like, the name or their faces. It was like, or maybe the same person in a different body. It was just the same shit over and over and over again. Like, X marks the spot. You, you was back in the same spot, but just with a different person. So, either you hadn't changed or you were going through, through some changes or some shit. Oh, my God, y'all. I don't know. What's this uh passion? What's this this what's, what's this over here? Okay. It's a lot. The King of Wands in reverse, the Chariot in reverse, and the Prince of Wands in reverse. And the Three of Wands. So three, three, three. Three, three, three. I don't even know if you can enjoy. So something is stopping you from pursuing this. I feel like this might be the same person. Or it's two out of the three. Or some shit like that. It might be all three of them. Hell, maybe this is something that you need to kind of stop. Maybe you need to stop and look. Because all these three people, or maybe this shit starts off the same. Maybe it starts off the same. It's so passionate and, you know, all of that. Y'all having a good time and, and y'all together. But it's like the same three people. So maybe there's some cycle that needs to be broken. But in the next three days, three weeks, three... Uh, 30 days to me. That's my saying. Three, three days, three weeks, 30 days. Something totally changes. I see you moving on. I don't even know if you're dealing with every all of these people. I see you moving on. I see you absolutely moving on. What is this? What's the Jackson 5? I'll be there. The Five of Coins. Yeah, they'll be there, but it's either this person doesn't have a lot to give. But I can say they do give what they can. But at the same time, I just feel like it's it's not a lot. They could still give you more. I'm not trying to say like money financially, but I mean, I don't know if this person is breaking bread with you. They giving it to somebody else or they do more for other people than they do for you. They, if it's always been like this, it's it's always going to be like that. So even though they say I'll be there, like, yeah, but you're not there for me. Like you're there for other people, especially this eight of swords in reverse. It's like they help you, but it's like they got to be sneaky with it or they don't do as much for you as they have done for other people or do for other people in the past or other people get in the way of your relationship. So that could be the reason why y'all broke up from the fucking get-go. What's this uh, Jaheen finding my way back? The Princess of Wands. Wow. So that's giving me the energy of two things. 
So somebody got betrayed by somebody else. And now they want to be with you. But you remember, I was like, they dealing with somebody else. But somebody, like, literally got betrayed. Or somebody got stung by somebody else. And they thought that this person was a good person. Like, okay, you don't want to fuck with me? Then I'll fuck with somebody else, right? And the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Like, this person, they running out of time. Somebody could be pregnant. Having a baby. Or, or somebody could have had a baby. Or it's just... Maybe that's why they're trying to find their way back. Remember earlier, I was like, they want their family back. But look, they still trying to call your ass. <laughs> Y'all something else, Aquarius. What's this? Can't take my eyes off of you. Eight of Swords in reverse. So this is future energy. And then you have the Ten of Cups here. So to me, I feel like you're learning your lesson or you have learned your lesson. Because I, I really do feel like somebody is... I feel like in order for you to move on, you need to kind of solve this these issues in the background over here. Like, What's this uh, three or this uh, Pisces, these fish cards? Oh... That was interesting. The three of wands and the queen of wands in reverse. And then the temperance is on the bottom. I don't know, y'all. I feel like you're, you're, you're going through this so it can all like equal out or pan out or something. There's something significant about the next three days, three weeks, 30 days. So either all of this shit about to come to a head, all of, and that's what I'm saying. I don't know if all these people going to run across each other or something. But I don't even know if you're dealing with all these people. Maybe they looking at you or they trying to deal with you. Like this Queen of Wands in reverse, I don't think you're interested in these people. Or there's something that's going on where you're not dealing with these people. Maybe you're celibate. Maybe I don't know what you got going on, but you're not fucking with this this devil energy or something like that. You're trying to like clear your mind or something like that. All right, so let's see what we got. You're going to go on a life-changing trip. Leo got that. Clarity, okay? That's why I said something's happening fairly soon where it's going to kind of bring things in perspective for you. Uh, the lovers is here. Life giving. Somebody is like either giving birth or some shit like that. Protection. Curiosity. And you have this room. So let me look that up because y'all know I don't know these rooms by heart. Which one is that? Okay, that one is, I can't see it, huh? I'm trying to make it bigger. The self, friends, yeah, mankind, the self, friends, enemies, and social order. Wow. So the self, yeah, that's why I was thinking like maybe it was something that you maybe needed to learn, this robotic energy, uh, friends, enemies, and social order. I don't know, y'all. Maybe your your friends is 
maybe one of your friends bring clarity to you or something like that. Uh, but I do feel like it is some type of a level of drama that comes with this shit too. I feel like you just kind of like minding your own business. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius, so you could have it in your chart because um, Aquarius came up in their reading twice, okay? So watch that. All right, you guys. So uh, Y'all just let me know how it's going, okay? Please like, share, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. If you have, um, if you have, I already appreciate it. Y'all already know what it is. Holla at the player when you see me in the streets, man. Bye.